Today, we're going to be talking about the Nothing Year 2. Now, normally, I don't make videos this time of the day. So if I'm wearing a shirt, I just came back from work. I pull a 12-hour day today and I'm tired, right? But um, Nothing Year 2 is going to be released, revealed actually, today, right? At 11.30 p.m. thereabouts, right? The embargo is going to be lifted. And I thought you guys need to know about this earbuds. These are phenomenal earbuds. This is the box, all right? And this is how the earbuds look like. Now I'm gonna allow you to zoom in just a little bit if you could catch that, okay? This is how it looks like. There's a transparent case that holds everything very, very nicely. It's a solid case feeling like acrylic, but I'm sure it's some kind of ABS plastic, it clicks shut very well. There is a USB-C uh, charging port and there's a connect button, but other than that, not much else. The battery is definitely housed in the uh, not transparent part of the case. Now, why am I rushing to make this video? Because I suspect if they don't make enough of these, you're gonna to have to wait a long time before you can get your hands on the Nothing Year 2. Now, I've heard of the company before, right? They've made phones as well. They've made one model of phone. They've made a previous Year 1. Not very imaginative, the naming convention, but they also have the Year Stick. Now, I haven't reviewed their products before, and when I received it, I still didn't pay much attention to it. So I reviewed the U-Green before. These are TWS earbuds. They're phenomenally cheap at $25, but no active noise cancelling. Solid, solid base quality. The treble is a little bit masked, so not that great. I also have the Devil A Gemini. Extremely well-engineered piece of uh, equipment from Devil A. And Devil A is a very, very big audio company, right? Um, not cheap, right? But they have cut the price recently. The base is phenomenal. ANC is great. And I love them. But what I use on a daily basis is actually the AirPods. So I've used the AirPods uh, Gen 1. I've used the AirPods Pro Gen 1. And now I'm at the AirPods Pro Gen 2. And I use them almost exclusively on a daily basis when it comes to work because they work great, right? Uh, connection is great. It shuffles between all my iOS and uh, uh, Mac OS devices flawlessly, including the iPads as well. So very convenient to use and the sound quality is great. The second gen actually improves on the first generation AirPods Pro and I'm very happy with them, but they are costly, right? It's like uh, 379 Singapore dollars at launch. Uh, can't remember what the price is. I think the Gen 2 actually came in a little bit cheaper, but it was still $300 over dollars, Singapore dollars. This nothing year one. Gen 1 cost $99 US dollars. I'm still not very sure of what the release pricing is. I think they have not announced it as of the time of me making this video, which is mere hours away, right, from uh, nothing releasing the information and the details themselves. But if price is not a concern, go for it, right? Because I don't think it's going to cross the 200 US dollars mark. The first version was 99 US dollars. This can't be very, very far. It's not going to double the price of it. And when you compare it with the AirPods Pro 2, which is basically quite my gold standard when it comes to earphones uh, and wireless earbuds today. With active noise cancelling, I, I have to tell you this, right? Why do I say that they're going to sell out? The bass is phenomenal. I don't have the year ones to compare them to, but the bass from this guy is really phenomenal, right? I like the bass from the U-Green, but the mids and the highs were a little bit recessed, so kind of like a view sound. Okay, but it's cheap. It's 20, 25 US dollars. The Devil A Gemini had phenomenal waves. So I'm going to place the base of the uh, Nothing Year 2 quite close to the Gemini. All right, but these are a factor of maybe two more times more expensive than the Year 2s. And then, of course, almost everybody I know uh, has the AirPods Pro 2. Sound is Good is not too bad, but if you're gonna ask me to split hair between 
the two devices here, the two earbuds here, I'm going to say that I'm going to give the win to the Nothing Gear 2 when it comes to sound quality for music. Now, features-wise, um, the software-wise, I can't really comment because I haven't had much time with this. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be reviewing these in that right especially when i get my hands uh on the software that will actually work with the year two right now they are um probably not compatible at the moment now what i have in my hands here right here is actually the nothing phone right so the nothing phone i'm looking at it is a really really nicely engineered phone very nice uh back the nothing phone is an android device right they have their own version of os is uh based off android 13 and uh, what is interesting about the phone is the glass back and when they say glass back you can tell it's a glass back because there is a transparent glass panel over it um aluminum sides it actually looks pretty much like an iPhone, uh, except for this, right? These are the lights that can come on and off, right? It's a very interesting phone, very, very unique. Now, these two will work very well together, but like I said, I haven't had much time with them. I will be releasing an in-depth video uh, comparing the earbuds against uh, the Apple AirPods Pro 2, against the Devil A Gemini, against even the cheap Ugreen TWS uh, high tune. I can't remember what the model, but very cheap, right? Um, and I will be comparing them in use with my regular iPhone as well as this nothing phone. I think it's going to be a great combination. I have heard the sounds coming through this earbuds and they are really phenomenal. I cannot believe that something south of a hundred dollars or maybe just a little bit more now, I don't know, but this price range, the performance, the value is unmatched. So if you're interested to find out more about this, I will be launching a video and I will be talking about them in depth. Now, if you have any questions that you want to ask and anything that you want to explore about the Nothing Year 2, please leave them in the comment section down below. I will be launching this video uh, right about when everybody else will launch the video. So I will be covering more things. So the more questions you ask in the comment section below, the more I can address them in the next video. And if you want to catch the answers to that video, all you have to do is to subscribe to the channel, leave a like, make sure that more and more people ask more and more questions so I can answer more and more of them in my next video. Um, meanwhile, stay tuned and I'll see you again when I get back with a more in-depth review.